Hey guys, today is going to be about the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color and I got them in two shades and I don't know about you but before I purchase any lip product I usually look online to see if there are any swatches on um, lips about for people around like my skin tone and I didn't see really any kind of swatches whatsoever for any skin tone and I was like okay well maybe there are new shades so I have Embrace and the second one is in the shade Kisses. Embrace is like a peachy pinky nude shade. This is a really nice pretty shade especially for someone that is my skin tone. And then the second color is Kisses and this is almost like a mixture between like a dusty rose and a mauve and a berry like all combined into one. They are really easy to apply. It has a interesting doe foot applicator. It's not really a doe foot. Um, it's more like thin and then thick again. It's more like a triangular shape so it makes it easier to get into like the little crevices like in the corners of your mouth like you know your cupid's bow and it gives you a really precise line like I didn't use any lip liner at all and I got a pretty good lining of my lips with this. What I noticed is it has a bit of a chemically sweet scent so it's very sickening and I'm not a fan of it, however, I am not opposed to having scented makeup products. I have plenty that I have smelled before that I have no issues with whatsoever. And this one isn't an issue either, but it just kind of smells a little bit too chemically and really annoying. I can deal with it. It's fine. I get over it, I put it on my lips, and then I keep on moving forward and I don't notice it the rest of the day. Um, it's only in those first few seconds while you're applying your lip product that it would have a lingering scent. After you have it on your, sorry, I just sniffed my nose. How do you do, how do you sniff a nose? You can't sniff a nose. I sniffed my lips. Okay. After that, then it's gone. I'm a little disappointed in the fact that they call it a matte lip color. Um, however, I noticed that they don't say a lipstick. So usually a lipstick will end up lasting a little bit longer than let's say like a lip gloss or something. I find this is more of a lip gloss lipstick hybrid. You know, it still holds up fine, it does pretty well, and it looks great on the lips, it's very full coverage, but it doesn't stay matte. And the only way that you can get matte is by putting your tissue paper on your lips and removing some of the excess shine. But if you want shiny, you know, like a lip glossy look, that's fine too. That's it for this little mini review. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe so that we can talk and become friends here on YouTube. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.